guys, look what just came. Did you guys hear that? You should see the comment section. Oh my god. It's like December has this this fast forward button. Well, that can't be your highlight because you're using your back pain to get out of the pregnancy journey. Larry, <laughs> he's drinking the spicy Kool-Aid. It might be a little fun because I'll be a little loopy. Right. I don't work. I'll remain calm. Remain calm. You want to come sniff with me? There's a lot of candles here. Very mild, actually. Smell harder. <laughs> Smell harder. Everybody and welcome to vlogmas day 14 so I have just woken up I need to turn on all the Christmas lights today is a loungewear day this loungewear super cozy I have a pretty bad headache right now um, Luna is wild it's raining here in Florida which is really nice we need the rain um, so I'm gonna insert some cozy clips now I'm gonna turn on all the lights and then I'm gonna make a really big glass of water and then I think I'm gonna sit on the couch with my little massager thing. I showed you guys that a long time ago, but I'll show it to you now for those who get headaches and migraines. This would be good. Or if you don't get headaches and migraines and you just get like neck tension, I'll show you this little thingy. Anyways, let's turn on all the Christmas lights. Let's make ourselves a big water and a coffee and hope this headache goes away. Don't know if it's because I barely finished my drink yesterday. So you guys saw in the cookie baking vlog that I had an adult beverage. Okay, I didn't finish it. <laughs> and I got a headache. I don't know if it's from that or if it's just tension. I don't know. But anyways, also, <laughs> the fold in by hand. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, I just have to say, I am somebody who usually takes things very literally. If the directions say fold in by hand, <laughs> I fold in by hand. So then I Googled last night or YouTubed fold in by hand and I saw these bread dough men, professional men folding it in by their hands. And I'm like, okay, so am I wrong or am I not wrong? Do some people use their hands? I have to ask my mom and dad if grandma used a spatula or if she literally did it by hand. I'll let you guys know. So. Maybe grandma did do it by hand. I don't know, you know, but I did, I don't know. All right, let's make ourselves some coffee, some water, turn on the lights, massage, and then we need to edit. Come on, Here, baby. Hand you the bean. There you are. There you go, baby. Happy kitties, warm kitties. Also, today is, what is that? Is that, oh, there's a big smudge on the camera. Hold on. Is that better? Probably, good. I filmed the whole intro with a massive smudge. That's great. Oh my gosh. So Larry got up really early this morning and he sent me this link that was about meteor shower. There was a meteor shower on December 13th and 14th. 13th was yesterday, 14th is today. So at the end of the vlog yesterday when I told you guys that we saw a shooting star, we actually did, it's a real deal. I was so excited, I can't believe we saw it. So that was fun. We'll be on the lookout for it tonight, although it's really rainy here, so if it's cloudy we won't see it, but we did see it last night. How freaking cool. I still have to turn it on and put water in it. Who is she today? Listen, my Keurig is... Listen. Oh, she don't want to do it now. 
Okay, well my Keurig's acting funny and overfilling beverages does not ever do that. Interesting. This Keurig better not be dying on me already. Maybe it was overused yesterday. I mean, we used it a lot this weekend for cookie baking, so it's possible. So this is the massager. So I will link it down below. I got it off of Amazon and it is wonderful. It can be kind of painful, I'm not gonna lie. So you put it on like this, you plug it in to the wall and then like you can pull, it hooks in your arms and you can pull down to make it tighter. You can do your mid back like this. You can do your lower back. So I'll link her down below. But I'm gonna do this for a little while before I edit and I'll catch up with you guys soon. I don't know what today's vlog's gonna be. It's gonna be a chill, casual day at home. I know a lot of you guys love those kinds of days, so, and I'm totally, totally ready to have a chilled day. So, let's have a chilled day together. Maybe we'll have a bath later, too. Who knows what's gonna happen. <laughs> I'm gonna go massage now. So, the mail is here. The mail doesn't usually come until like two o'clock here, and it's 9 a.m. and the mail is here. I like it. I like it. Maybe it's the foot pedal. <laughs> what is that? Oh my god, that was startling. Yes, yes, somebody's at the door. Also, I am editing the part of the vlog. This is cookie day two vlog that I'm editing now. Yesterday's vlog, as you guys saw it. I just, I'm smiling the entire time watching my dad's footage and how well he did with recording. Like, he was such a savior like everybody in my family I just have to give them a huge shout out and for you guys for being patient with me and watching vlogmas and it just means the world to me but everybody was such a big help over the weekend because I mean the fact that I didn't even start the vlog yet because I had edited all morning long and then like I got in the shower and they were at the door and I opened the door and I'm like hi it started um and then my dad's like where's your camera I'll start filming and I'm like thank god sweet here you go and what he captured I've just been smiling the entire time so big humongous shout out to my hubby my family and you guys for being amazing and I cannot believe we're halfway through vlogmas already so anyways I'm gonna stop being mushy and I'm gonna edit the vlog <laughs> guys look what just came so this i believe is a thomas kincaid christmas thing and then these are collectible pieces and it's a beautiful flower arrangement with roses and pine and flowers and it's from my mom and give you guys a better look there you go look how beautiful it is so i think luna's all excited i think i want to put this like here Maybe move the Santa Claus, or not move him, but move this. Move it. Move that and put this here. Oh my gosh. Yes, that's what we were missing. This table was missing that. Look how pretty. And then we can put the Santa here. Oh my goodness. Doesn't that look gorgeous? Mm -hmm. That was so, so, so kind. Uh oh. Luna. Luna, are you gonna, don't eat it, okay? We'll see how long we'll be able to keep it there. Probably not very long. Aww. What? It's a military guy coming home. Oh, that's nice. Aww, anticlimactic. <laughs> While we're taking a break from editing, um, I'm gonna open those packages that I received and show you guys what arrived. Our cord came in Yay. from GG Seasons for our tree. That's this box. <laughs> and then this I'm thinking is from Etsy. We'll see, I hope it is. I ordered one crew neck sweater back in November that I still have not gotten. So hopefully it's that one. It's not, I wonder if it got lost. I ordered, oh wait, no, it's not. Um, but I will link these down below for you guys. I saw this and I was like, how simple and cute are these pine tree situations? Okay, so I ordered that in a large for that oversized look. And then the seller also had 
Harry Potter inspired. And I was like, but this is the cutest Harry Potter inspired ever. It's not loud Harry Potter. Just, just look, just for my Harry Potter fans out there. Look at this. So it's the Herbology or Herbology, Herbology. <laughs> Don't come at me if I said it wrong. Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. And it has all these beautiful plants and herbs. And then it says what they are down below. I could not pass that up. I mean, seriously. So that's what I got. Uh, hey, babe. Yeah. You have tape? Uh, I mean, not tape, <laughs> scissors <laughs> to cut through my tape. This that I ordered on eBay, I might not be able to show you guys. We'll see, hopefully, because if it's a pr Christmas present, I can't show it to you. I can share this because I was talking to my mom about it and I bought the last two that the seller had. And it's this, which my mom and I both love. I'm almost out of mine and my mom's already finished hers. This is the best leave-in conditioner. It looks like this, it smells amazing. It's by AG Hair Care and it's called Fast Food. And it's a leave-in conditioner. Yeah. Oh, what's she eating? I don't know. Shoot. Oh, boy. What'd she do? Luna! Did she eat the plant? Dirty. <gasps> Luna! Luna! Come here, baby. She's coming out the back side. There should be another one around here. Come here. Somewhere. What's he doing? What did you do? Come here. Come here. Okay, I found them both. She already got into it, didn't she? Yeah. We're gonna have to pull it off the table. Luna Bean already got into the plant and she pulled pins off of it. Yes, we're gonna have to move it. That lasted on the table a whole two minutes, didn't it? Lexi's eating it. Lexi's eating it? Oh, let's move it up to the fireplace <laughs> right now. <laughs> right now, we gotta move it. is wound up like a mad woman. Now she's playing with scissors. Is she? Really, Luna? Oh my God. That's mom's fault for leaving scissors on the floor. She's training me, that's all. How's that look, babe? That looks very nice. Yeah? Yeah. When you have cats or kids, we don't have kids, but cats yeah. apparently are preparing us. <laughs> yeah. So we moved the garland off the fireplace, and it actually fits perfectly in a circle around this area. Hi, Lexi. You're such a good girl. Lexi's like, I am a queen, and mother, I would never mess with your stuff. My little <laughs> feisty one is right there. Hi, Nuna. What's he doing? I see you wiggling your butt. Are you coming to pounce? Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, and then we moved the beautiful arrangement up here by the TV. I think it looks really nice. Sorry, Luna. <gasps> A flower fell off. <laughs> Luna! <laughs> Anyways, what I was saying was this leave-in conditioner is amazing. I'll link it down below for you guys. It's great stuff. It smells divine as well. The mama's calling. Gotta take Bluetooth it off the Bluetooth. Caring. Hello? Sorry I missed your call. That's I okay. Was, um... Yay, FaceTime. Hi. So, I got a special delivery today. You did. You guys are so sweet. That's my, I got the beautiful floral arrangement. Is that the Thomas Kincaid piece or is, yeah, is it? That's my first one. We couldn't um, leave you out. We thought you deserved it. Thank you, it was so sweet, it's beautiful. Would you like to see it? Yes, yeah. please. Okay, okay, so I've got my mom on the phone. Mom, when grandma folded in by hand the ingredients for the Ranger cookies, did she use her hands or did she use a spatula? She used her hands. They were washed and she used her hands. That's what I'm talking about. Do you know how many people 
were like, I don't think grandma literally meant fold it in by hand. She meant use a spatula. And I'm like, no, I could have sworn grandma used her hands. Like grandma was a hands-on person. Yeah. yeah, she they were washed and cleaned and sanitized, but she used her hands. Did you guys hear that? You should see the comment section. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh man, I was like, maybe I did do it wrong. Maybe it wasn't to be taken literally. Okay, there we have it. Okay, I did nothing wrong. I followed grandma's direct orders. Well, that makes me happy. Okay, I'm off the hook, guys. Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to sort yeah. laundry with you. Right. <sighs> Time to sort. <laughs> Still sorting, my mom. It's never ending. Yes, it looks like it's not. <laughs> We're almost there, though. What are you doing? <laughs> Lexi, what is she doing? What? What is she doing? Are you watching her? <laughs> oh my gosh, Luna. <laughs> She's going wild. <laughs> oh. Really? <laughs> Luna, that is not how you treat your sister. It's okay, Max. Luna. Luna. Oh my God, she's a Christmas tree terror. She has been. Yeah, she's chewing on the actual tree now. Let me see. She's walking away now. She's gonna go sniff the camera. I'm recording her, so she's. <laughs> she's been caught. The paparazzi caught Luna. Uh huh. What is that, Luna? Twelve thirty-five. Oh God! See you later, Mindy. Enjoy your lunch. Where are you going? Well, where's my shows? I'm your show. <laughs> Come on, Jack. She Bye. Like, See ya. Bye. Yeah, she's like, I don't care. <laughs> Is it Gone with the Wind? What's on? Not Gone with the Wind. Uh, <laughs> Bold and the Beautiful. <laughs> Young and the Restless. <laughs> It's going on. It's three o'clock. I'm still not done with this edit yet, but I'm gonna go check to see what came in the mail. I was gonna show you guys something else and I don't, I, I've done lost track of my, oh no, I wasn't gonna show you guys something. I needed to change the laundry. That's what I need to do. Not very fun stuff, but I need to transfer the towel load into the dryer and put this big kahuna load in the washer. My hair, whatever. My camera battery died, but I don't know how much it captured, but I was panicking because I was like, it's three o'clock and I don't have the vlog that's going up today finished. I don't even have it up, up edited and fully uploaded. But my point was, as I was starting to say before the, the camera cut me off, that it's like December has this, this fast forward button. I swear time in December goes so much quicker than any other month. And then it's like January comes and January and February, I feel like go really slow. Don't know if we're in focus, but don't you feel that way? Like December, like January, February are kind of slower. I did Ohio and it was cold. Yeah. But I just feel like, I don't know. December always flies. I think it's just because everybody's hustling to get things in order and, and then, you know, I always think like, yay, Christmas, you know, the countdown to Christmas. But then somebody posted today on Instagram, like, it's actually, we only have two weeks left of 2020. Like, it's the countdown to the end of the year. I'm good with that. I mean, 2020 has been, let's be honest. 
the most interesting year probably in in the world for for the world <laughs> like it's up there with one of those years in in all time i mean when you hear your grandparents like my grandparents say that they've never seen anything in their lifetime like what they have in 2020 that tells you a lot right there so it's not us <laughs> it's not me being dramatic you know it's just it's just crazy but let me know you know what this is a good idea let me know what your highest moment was in 2020 something that was incredible and amazing that is a positive let's keep it positive for me it would be larry and i starting the pregnancy journey i think for me that's what it is like going to the fertility appointments and securing our precious cargo i think that is my biggest highlight of 2020. yes babe what about you no, that can't be your highlight because you're using your back pain to get out of the pregnancy journey because everybody that knows us so well, that is so in tune with everything that we do on a daily basis, will tell us that you're just skating on that and using your back as an excuse. So that can't be it. You have to come up with a different one. Larry's been hanging out in the comment section too much. Larry, <laughs> he's drinking the spicy Kool-Aid. There, okay, there's a group of people that think that I am full of it and I don't actually want to get pregnant at all and I'm just using that and I'm using my back as an excuse. That is just people, I don't even understand why you would think that, like why you would say that. It's just sad, but that's just people, you know, like, like, you know, we have to remember, like Dr. Phil said, some people love to hate. And then some people take a 20 minute video, even a long video. Okay. Like they take a 40 minute video and assume they know everything that you did that day and everything about your life, ev everything. But I do want to come on and say that that is like a small percentage of you guys. Like the majority of you, Larry and I, um, just are so thankful and we love you so much. No, it's that hot chocolate I had with the cough syrup. <laughs> no, but really, we do want to thank you guys. And it is only a small percentage. and But it is annoying, like frustrating when you see that one comment and it's like you focus on it and you're looking at it like... Well, especially when that's the comment. And, and yeah. For, for that particular person, one person out of the entire world that thinks that, you're more than welcome to join us tomorrow at the doctor when she gets a needle shoved in her spine because she has to have injections now. Yeah, which I'm trying to do in order to like be perfectly okay when I, which I'm not going to be, but I'm gonna be better. You but anyways, can do it. But they'll know because they're gonna be coming to the appointment with me. Of course, I can't film myself on the table getting a needle and Larry's not allowed back in with me because it's an operating room and COVID. he's not allowed to come back and COVID and everything else like that. But I might not even be allowed in the office. They do get to come to the, uh, the appointment with us. <laughs> It'll be a fun vlog. Yeah, she's not going to be allowed to drive after that. It might be a little fun because I'll be a little loopy. <laughs> Woohoo! And that would be different than any other day. How? True! <laughs> We're drinking the spicy Kool-Aid today. It's been a... It's been a... Oh, I forgot. I got to hit the machines. I have to start. I can't be talking. I need to go and finish that one. It's going to be late! Quit goofing off and doing laundry. Go do some work. I know. Quit goofing off. What do you mean? I don't work, Larry. Oh yeah, that's right. I don't work. Do you need this one started? <laughs> yes, I do. I need that one started too. No, in all honesty, I am very fortunate to have the job that I do. I wouldn't trade it for the world. And when I did work my nine to five jobs every day, I loved it and I was so thankful for it. But this is a dream. It was a dream for me and you guys have made it happen. So again, a huge thank you to you guys for supporting us and loving us. Even the spicy ones out there Keep who, coming. who like to add and sprinkle a little spice into our lives. You know, we appreciate you too. So even though, you know, it's not always necessary to be so spicy, spice is, you know, what's going to happen. So cheers. Now I need to go edit and quit talking. I'll be back. Show emotions, we just keep it down, down inside. Yeah, you and I both longing for expression for the things we like, but we stay quiet. Hold me now, hold me now. Tell me things, tell me all about how you feel. Just let yourself go.
think my Bath and Body Works is arriving right now. My order, it's at the door. It's here! All right, let's do our Bath and Body Works haul. I've got two boxes. One box arrived a while ago, and then this one arrived today. The first box is a small box. And one of the orders was from Cyber Monday, and then one of the orders was from their sale, which is the best sale. Well, doesn't that look appealing? all lined up okay actually this was a sale that they must have been having on their aromatherapy range which is my favorite i pretty much only like these now as shower gels instead of their normal shower gel range this is my favorite so i picked up orange and ginger which i pretty much was thinking safe for summer and spring oh it smells good it kind of smells like pledge though as well babe come smell this and tell me if you think this smells like orange pledge i think i've gotten the candle and that's literally what i thought yeah does it or does it not yeah it does it does okay well that's okay <laughs> and then i've got the eucalyptus stress relief so i got all of these thinking for the future like thinking indulge and get everything that I'm gonna need to remain calm. And if I get sick or I'm, you know, 2021, you know what I'm saying? So cheers to all of these. So this is the stress relief. You get what I'm saying without me having to say it, guys? Remain calm, remain calm. <laughs> so I got the stress relief one, which I really like. I used to not like this. And I used to think that it smelled like men's cologne and a little too strong but I actually really, really enjoy it now. So I got that one. I got another orange ginger, another eucalyptus stress relief. Ooh, stress relief eucalypt eucalyptus tea. Let's see. Ooh, 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 she's moving. Ooh, I like this better. Oh my God, I like this better. And then another one of the same scent, the eucalyptus tea. And then I think, oh, I got three of the sleep. Oh, I think because my mom wanted one. Okay, so sleep is cedarwood and vanilla. And I love cedarwood and I also love vanilla. So let's see. Ooh, that smells incredible. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's a really, <laughs> I think this might be my new favorite scent. It's between these two. I think are my favorite scents. These are amazing. I'm not, I'm not so keen on the pledge. Wait, wrong one. This one. Oh, did you hit your head? She hit her head. All right, so that's it on the aromatherapy soaps. I'm glad they didn't leak all over the place because they weren't sealed. You like the vanilla and cedar wood? They're great. And I think these can go both ways for men and women. I don't really think this is just for women or just for men. I think that all of them can go both ways. Okay, they're originally $13.50. I got them on sale for oh, $5.95. That's why I bought in bulk. That's why I'm, I'm a sale shopper. I always wait to buy for those sales. Like Bath & Body Works candles are normally 24 something. I have never purchased a candle at Bath and Body Works full price ever in my life. You wait for the sales. These candles were $9.95. That's what I'm talking about. You wanna come sniff with me? There's a lot of candles here. The joys of sniffing candles, what do you mean? Okay. <laughs> He's like, great. <laughs> because we have to have a male perspective here. Right guys? Don't you want Larry's perspective? I know you do. I know they do. Okay, first up, we have Tis the Season. You almost hit yourself. Oh That's my good. God. Potpourri. Mm. <laughs> okay, keynotes, rich red apples, sweet cinnamon, and cedar wood. This one smells divine. I give it a thumbs up. I'm gonna bring you guys a little closer. Beep, 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 beep. There we go, okay. Oh, you're only supposed to make the beep, beep, beep noise when it's oh. backing up. Haha. Uh -huh. Next up, we have a snowflake top, and this is twisted peppermint. We know what this smells like, but it's fun to sniff it anyways. Yep. This has been a favorite of mine forever since I started shopping at Bath, Bath, Bath and Body Works. So this is cool peppermint, sugared snow, vanilla cool. buttercream, fresh balsam with a hint of musk. Mm. You like? I like. Next up. I like oh, this is a new one. 
cinnamon and clove buds. I'm very excited to smell this one. And how cute is the packaging? Little reindeer. Ready? Ready. Is mm. it amazing? It's not bad. Not bad? No, I'm trying to think what it's... Uh, it reminds me of something. I know exactly what it reminds me of. What does it remind me of? Have you thought? No. Smell again. I know. I'll see if you find out. What is it? The little spicy hot mints. Yeah. They're the little red hot candies. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's it. You nailed it. This is perfect. That's exactly what it smells like. Let's see. Cinnamon leaf, clove bud, and ground nutmeg. So good. I like that. Coconut and sandalwood. Some of these candles are for the warmer months, so this would be one of those that I want to save for this kind of got summer. A, a Western theme. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? I got two of these because mom also wanted one. Tell me if you like it. Mm, not so much. No? No. Oh, not what I was thinking. I don't even smell the coconut. Do you? Not at all. No. Very mild, actually. Smell harder. <laughs> smell harder. It's a very mild coconut, but I'm not really thrilled. That's kind of disappointing. Coconut palm, luxurious sandalwood, warm musk, and jasmine. Maybe it'll smell different when it's burning. We'll see. I got that in mind for bathrooms and for summer. Cranberry pear bellini. This is a new one for us. I have high hopes for this. A little bit more on the fruity side, I'm sure. Oh yeah, very much so. In a negative way? Hmm. Okay. Oh, I like it. Summertime candle. This is not, I mean, it's for Christmas, but this is summer. Yeah. It's maybe, peach. Maybe with all the windows open and everything. And... <laughs> Don't run away, Luna. Larry, not a fan of that candle. So maybe much. with all the windows open. Well, we're not having the windows open in the summer. No. No. My back hurts sitting like that. Ooh, this is pretty. A little green moment. Ooh, eucalyptus mint. Another prob probably a bathroom candle. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that one. I don't know. I have a feeling it's going to smell like men's cologne. Eucalyptus can smell that way. Yeah. Oh, I can't. <laughs> I can't. I'll, I'll get a headache. I already know. Mm. I, I'm going to have to see if mom wants that. That is an instant trigger, I can tell. Mm -mm. Nope. Uh. Uh -uh. Okay, mahogany coconut. Another summer scent in mind. That's not bad. That is much better than the coconut sandalwood. Yes. Kind of reminds me of vacation. Yeah. I like it. Okay, so this one is creamy coconut, mahogany woods, and English lavender. Luna, don't eat the box. <laughs> Two more to go. She needs more fiber. Oh, the other candle sandalwood. Candle sandalwood. Coconut. Candle sandal. <laughs> coconut sandalwood. That one is for mom. And then, oh, sorry. I got another cranberry peach bellini. Cranberry pear bellini. What was your favorite? Uh, one of the early ones. Yeah, one of the Christmas ones? Yeah. Let me see. I think I know mine. I'm putting these ones back. Tis the Season and Cinnamon Clove Buds. Yeah. Which one do you like better? Yeah, I think that one. We need to go do our advent calendar, so let's go do that. Here's your calendar. Are you going with your candy cane? Stay with the cane. We are at day... 16? No, no, 14. 14, here it is. He's getting way ahead of himself. <laughs> Rain man without the math skills. <laughs> oh no, it's ripping. Not a candy cane, but I candy think. Candy. Oh, it's cute. It looks like a teddy bear. It is. Look. He's got a bow tie. He is so sweet. He does. Very spiffy teddy bear. It is. Ready? Ready. Cheers. Cheers. I was really hungry. I started to eat it. Yeah. Caught my fingers to make sure she didn't eat me out there all there. <laughs> Delicious. Larry and I are stepping outside to look at the sunset. It's another gorgeous one. And we have to come out late tonight and look at meteor showers. I've already ended this vlog and I'm back to filming it. <laughs> oh, that's funny. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog today. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave a comment down below and we'll see you guys again very soon.
Bye. Bye. What was that? Bye.